Welcome back to another episode of the Great Enchant Table Race. This is number 163 and we're at it again. Trying to craft that enchanting table as quickly as possible and enchant a book after that. We've got a village nearby. This is a new random hardcore seed for this challenge and we've got a lot of animals right here at spawn including sheep and cow and so I'm sure we'll be able to get our books on the surface and then we'll see how we're going to go about getting our diamonds. But first, we need some resources for starter tools, so let's take this entire tree down to the ground. What can we get that's good at the village? Uh, if there's a blacksmith house, we could get some iron, obsidian, and there's a chance for diamonds, but uh, I don't see one. I do see a cleric house, which means there's a chance for a lapis trade, but that's usually the slower way to get lapis. So we'll try to find it underground uh, before we attempt a trade for lapis. Okay, there we go. We've got some wood from this tree, and now we just need some stone. Uh, where can we find some stone? I think I'll just dig in for stone, because I want to go after these animals next. So that we can get food and leather. Uh, so okay, there we go. We've got some uh, stone down here. So let's put the crafting table down and make a pickaxe. And then we'll start getting some stone for tools here. Ah, uh, the stone is a little deeper than I was hoping. But there it is. Everything we need to craft some tools. Uh, let's make a pickaxe first. So that we can mine some more stone. Just a little bit quicker. Hey, we've got coal down here. That's great. We can use that for fuel and for crafting torches for our caving adventure to find diamonds and possibly lapis and obsidian as well. We'll see what we need to actually get underground once we get there. Uh, okay, that's not enough stone yet. Let's keep going and then we'll grab the coal next as well and head back up to the surface. Uh, I still need some more wood, but we might be able to just pull some logs from the village houses. Uh, if there are no other trees around, that is. Okay, that's plenty of stone. Now let's grab as much coal as we can get. I'm hoping for a fast sub-30 minute time for this challenge. Let's see what we can do. Uh, usually to get the fast challenges, what I need is uh, a lot of help. <laughs> and uh, so far, it's looking like a good seed, but I haven't seen anything that exciting. Uh, here, let's get rid of the dirt on the hotbar, and it's time to craft a couple of furnaces. Here we go. Let's just take two for now. Um, I would like to make some torches. Not that many, just a, a few to get us started. And there we go. Uh, we can take... Oh, I didn't craft an axe, apparently. Oh, and I used all my sticks. <clears throat> Alright, there we go. Now we can craft an axe, and we got our furnaces done already. So it's time to go back up to the surface and start looking for some stuff. Now we can probably get a bed at the village, so I'm not going to worry too much about the sheep. Uh, let's just use the the cows here to get the food and leather we need. And so we've got six beef, and we do have the, what is it, three leather. So we're going to be able to make books as soon as we can get enough sugar cane. I'm going to try to make the books even before we go over to the village. Even if there's a book house, I want to make sure that we can get our books done for sure. Uh, this is not going to be enough sugar cane right here, so... Hmm, let's look around and see if we can't find some more than... Some more sugar cane somewhere, please. Uh, Ruin portal would be great. Uh, there's turtles here, but I don't see any more sugar cane. I think we should head toward the village now. What's the fastest way to get there, over land or by boat? I'm sure maybe we can find some other resources um, on the way. Let's try to get there over land. Uh, okay, this terrain is perilous, treacherous even. And is there any more sugarcane on the way to the village? I don't see any. 
Maybe once we get a little closer, I'll be able to see it. There we go. Wait. Oh, no, that's tall grass. <laughs> that's not sugar cane. Uh, what about on this side? Any sugar cane over here? No. But we've got some ocean on this side. Oh, there we go. Sugar cane. All we needed to do was head to the village. Okay, that's enough. We have all the resources we need for our books. Uh, so what we're looking for now is... Anything at the village that can help. Oh, we've got a lava pool over here. That's going to be a good way to get obsidian later. Uh, what can we get at this village? Okay, let's grab a bed. And before I forget, let's go ahead and craft... Dang it, let me out of this house, Bobby. All right, let's go ahead and craft the um, books. I don't want to forget about the books. Okay, so there's our two books, and we'll save the leather, but we don't need the sugar cane, so we'll just plant it down there. Now let's see what we can get at this village. There's the uh, cleric house. No chest in there. Uh, oh, right, I still need wood. Okay, let's grab wood from uh, this guy's like vegetable garden here. <laughs> How much do we need? Not that much. Let's just grab all the logs from each side. Uh, there's bound to be a couple chests in this village, but I don't think we're going to get much out of them. And I don't see a blacksmith house. No, I don't think we're going to find one of those here. Uh, we could use the hay bales. There's plenty of them. Uh, we could use them for food. Hmm... Okay, let's grab some wood from this tree. Uh, I would prefer to trade the hay bales if we need lapis later. Because if we eat them all now... Oh, there's a chest. A hey, bread. Okay, so let's not worry about the hay bales then. A couple of empty maps there. And let's go ahead and cook some food. Uh, we can use coal. Sure, I can afford that. Turn these logs into planks. Wow, we have a lot of wood. <laughs> All right, so we should be good on food now. I don't think there's anything else we're going to get at this village. Uh, we've got some better food coming in. So I'd like to wait for this to cook. And then I think we'll just dig down underground right here. Unless... Is there a shipwreck? Here, let's make a boat and take a look real quick while we're waiting for our food. Um, I also need to eat, so let's have some of this bread. I don't see any shipwrecks, but we can go out. We can go out real quick and have a look. It's going to have to be real quick, though. Okay, there's something across the water here. What is that? That's just, that's just sand, right? Okay, there is a shipwreck. We do have a shipwreck. All right. So we should go after that next. Um, but before we go after the shipwreck, let's go back for our food. And we'll keep this village in mind if we need lapis. If we get desperate for lapis at the end, we'll come back here. Uh, otherwise, we're probably just done with this village. All right, let's take the whole furnace with us. Food should be done cooking. Yeah, we got all the food. And then uh, we'll go back in the boat here and try to head toward that shipwreck. Uh, it is almost nighttime, and the shipwreck looked... Well, it looked a little bit deep, a little bit far underwater. So it's not going to be so easy to loot, but uh, let's try. We can sleep if we need to, including underwater. We, c we can sleep underwater. I did grab a bed from that village. So what do we want at the shipwreck? I think what we're looking for is iron and lapis. Okay, where is that shipwreck? I don't see it now. I know I was headed the right direction. Okay, there it is. I see it just up on the left. And I'm going to go ahead and leave it nighttime. We don't need the day for now. Okay, there's the ship. I see it. We're almost directly over it. Now, this shipwreck could lead us to some buried treasure. It looks like a full ship. Uh, let's go 
down and take a look. Uh, I'll take my boat with me, I guess. All right, let's go after the um, the loot. Well, there's a chest right here, I guess. <laughs> What's on these pants? I'll take those. Uh, there was paper in there as well, but I don't really need paper. I uh, hear drown, I think. Uh, anyways, there should be a chest in here. Okay, yeah, it's got some paper, armor trim, and we did get a buried treasure map. Yeah, let's wear these. Uh, let's wear these leather leggings. I do hear a drown. Uh, okay, I see it now. It does not have a trident, so we should be fine. Let's swim in and see what's in. This is the valuable loot right here. Okay, we got one diamond, uh, some iron, and I'll take the emeralds as well. And now I need to get out of here <laughs> without drowning. Okay, there we go. So one diamond, that's great. Let's get back in our boat and take a look at this buried treasure map. All right, it looks like we're headed the right way. So let's go see if we can find this uh, loot. I think I'm going to need to sleep. Yeah, the treasure is going to be right up here, but there's also going to be a bunch of mobs spawning. Where'd that bed go? Put it on the hot bar. Oh, that's not what I... You know what we could do? How, how far down is this? <laughs> let's just sleep on the ocean floor. <laughs> All right, I do want my bed back, though. That's the tricky part. All right, hopefully we did prevent some spawns by sleeping, although I do see a creeper. All right, we're almost there. This is the way to the buried treasure. Uh, I do not have a shield, so let's, uh, let's try not to blow up the creeper here. There we go. That's how that's done. Take notes. <laughs> no, you're probably better at this game than I am. Thanks for watching, by the way. <laughs> All right, how are we almost there? Uh, yes, the buried treasure is right here. And now we should be able to lose the map, bring up our coordinates, and find the exact location, which is going to be right... Oh, wrong way. Right here. Uh, looks like we won't have to dig that much. And is it there? I don't see it. Okay, we might have to dig. Oh, it's under me. I see. I see what I did there. And we've got buried treasure. We've got iron, uh, another diamond, and some more emeralds. Uh, I'll take the food as well, because we really don't have that much. Okay, um, so since we got all that iron, let's go ahead and use it. Ooh, you know what? If we could find four obsidian and some lapis, <laughs> we'd be we'd be all set. Uh, okay, let's turn these nuggets into ingots. That gives us 21 iron to use. Uh, we'll make a shield first. Uh, let's go ahead and make a iron pickaxe because I don't know when we're gonna find enough diamonds. And I would also like to upgrade my regular axe because we can afford to do that. Uh, some armor would be nice. Let's go ahead and make boots. And I would like to have a water bucket as well. Uh, let's fill that with water. And have a bite to eat while we think about what we want to do next. Um, hmm. Let's, let's see, what do we want to do next? Well, we need lapis, so we should probably just go underground. We've got two diamonds, but that's not enough to mine obsidian, so we still need a way to get that. I don't suppose there could be like a ruined portal around somewhere. That would be huge for us. Uh, what is this? This stone area, uh, this sand area over here is very strange. I'm thinking it's time to go mining. Here, let's see if we can get back up here. Yeah, that's nothing. This is just kind of a beach area. And I don't see a ruin portal. There could be one out in the ocean as well. We could try to collect obsidian that way, but 
I think we should just go underground. We should just find a place and dig straight down. And this seems like a good spot right here. Maybe we'll get lucky. <laughs> or maybe we won't. But uh, here we go. Uh, I don't need the bed anymore. Not on my hotbar anyway. Alright, so what do we want down here? Just lapis and diamonds, I guess. We do have a lava pool if we go back to the uh, village. That might be a good way to get obsidian. But to mine it, we're going to need three more diamonds. So down we go. Hmm. It's not looking too good underground. Okay, that's iron. Ooh, we've got some redstone here. We're still just a little bit high up. Um, let's keep going down. But it looks like my inventory is full. Okay, deep slate. I need a cave. Because it's pretty unlikely we're going to mine into lapis or diamond. I don't hear any game sound, uh, cave sounds, that is. Yeah, it's not looking too good here. <laughs> also, I would like to pick up some of these blocks, so let's get rid of our iron nugget. Don't need it. Don't want it. Okay, we found a cave. Uh, so that's very lucky. We've got a spider up here. And what else? We've got gold. Okay, that's just a dead end. So let's get rid of this spider. And have some food. I don't see diamonds yet. I don't see lapis either. Let's have a look around. How many torches do I have? Let's make a few more. Uh, I need sticks. <laughs> All right, that, that didn't work out exactly as planned, but here, that's a lot of sticks. Now we can make plenty of torches. All right, here we go. Got our torches ready. Hey, that's a creeper. Uh, okay, I you can blow up, I guess. Let's wait for the zombie. Uh, no, the zombie took a little damage, but not enough. Uh, another creeper. It's just faster to let them blow up. And how we doing? Did you guys expose any ores for me? Not really, huh? What's down this way? This is a really good low level cave. Oh, and it goes even lower. Uh, okay, I see gold. Here, let's just jump in. Uh, that's a skeleton. <laughs> and we've got some... More stuff to explore. Okay, plenty plenty of cave here. Um, I want to get rid of some junk into this lava. And that'll give us uh, some inventory space. Where'd that skeleton go? Oh, there he is. You're not going to scare me out of my diamond level cave? Okay, let's go back and look. We still need ores. Uh, we've got gold. Oh, there's a cave up there. Oh, there. okay, this way. We've got another creeper. Oh, two of them. And what else? Oh, another creeper. <laughs> because, of course, there is. And still no ores. Okay, there we go. Finally, we have diamonds. Um, and then so we're going to be able to get obsidian down in the cave, I think. We just need to find lapis to finish the challenge. That's all we're missing. And it looks like we got some extra diamonds here. Let's go ahead and use them to craft a diamond pickaxe. Oh, I forgot we got armor trim too. We should, If we have any extra resources at the end of the challenge, we can trim some armor. Uh, okay, so lapis. That's all we really need is lapis, but we can go get we can go get obsidian anytime. And I thought I saw a place to do that, maybe down here. It was low level cave, and it had well, 
Okay. There's a lot of low-level cave here, but uh, what I saw had lava at the bottom. Let's go see if we can find that again. Where was it? It was back through here, I think? Yeah, yeah, here, maybe? I see the light. Oh, it's flowing lava. Okay, okay. So that is not what I was looking for. Uh, I don't think we should follow this flowing lava. Although, it could take us down to lava level. So, we do have a quick pick. It's not a bad strategy. Where does that... Okay, the lava ends there. Uh, we're back. We're back over at the uh, cave that I saw earlier. Yeah, let's just jump in. Let's just jump into this water here, and then we'll go... Okay. <laughs> I guess we're as low as we're going to get then. I don't like being kind of stuck down here in this ravine area. Uh, I don't see lapis, though. Let's see. What, what Y level am I at? Uh, not quite low enough. Let's staircase down a bit and see if we can find lava down here. Otherwise, we'll have to surface and go all the way back to a lava pool. That could take a while, but so could this. I'm not sure which one is faster. Okay, this should be lava level right here, but I don't hear any. Hey, we found more diamonds. How about that? <laughs> I don't need more diamonds. I need lapis. Okay, there's iron here. Yeah, this is kind of silly. Strip mining for diamonds? I can accept that. Strip mining for lapis and lava? No, 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 no. There's got to be a better way. This is a waste of time. Oh, <laughs> did you see the block glitch? <laughs> That's almost unfair. It's so cheaty. Um, but yeah, there's definitely more cave this way. I saw it. More cave and it definitely had lava? Uh, it wasn't exactly straight, though. It was slightly diagonal, so we're going to have to adjust a little bit. I don't know how far away it was, though, so this could still be a bad idea. But let's see if we can make it over to what I saw when the block glitched. I still don't hear it, but we should be getting close. This is such a waste of time. <laughs> Why am I doing this? Oh, I hear it now. I hear lava. We're getting close. Where is it? Where is it? This diamond pick is quick, but we're still losing a lot of time here. And I don't hear the lava anymore. Maybe I should dig up. Where did I hear the lava? Here?
All right, we're going up. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna actually just go straight up. Okay, I hear the lava again. That's good. And there's a cave here. Perfect. Okay, we found the lava. It was harder than it needed to be, I think. <laughs> uh, let's light up this area over here. Because we're probably going to leave this way. And I just wanted to see if maybe there was some lapis. So we could finish the challenge, but it doesn't look like... Okay, there's more lava down here. Okay, I saw redstone. More redstone. Uh, maybe we can follow this lava out. Um, but let's at least collect the obsidian we need now. All right, how many obsidian do we need? I think we need all four. Yeah, we didn't get any obsidian yet. Okay, that's one. Uh, hmm. There we go. First piece of obsidian done. Three more to go. Then all we need is lapis to finish the challenge. Why is it always lapis? <laughs> I feel like I get stuck on lapis quite a bit, which is maybe a good thing, because I added the additional book enchanting to uh, make, oh, I think, is that all of my obsidian done? No, I need one more. Yeah, I added the um, additional book enchanting at the end of the uh, challenge to make it harder, and if it means getting an extra book and lapis slows me down, then that's probably a good thing. All right, let's see if we can find a way out now. Uh, we can make the enchanting table. I guess that would save us a little bit of room in our inventory. Not much, though. Just the obsidian would become a spot for the enchanter. Uh, okay, I do want this back. So you go away, you go away. There we go, we're good now. And my water. Need the water. All right, here we go. Looking for lapis. That's all we need. I, did, I don't have any, right? <laughs> no, I don't have any lapis. Okay. Uh, this goes nowhere. So we're going to have to mine our way out. Uh, uh, okay, let's head back to the village then. I need my boat. And where was that village anyway? I don't see it. Is this the right way to go? Oh, okay, I see it now. There's the village. That's going to take me a while to get there. Um, what's the plan? Let's make a plan for when we get to the village. Uh, so we're missing lapis. We need to get the lapis on the surface. We know that's a trade with the cleric villager. We need... Emeralds to make the trade. There are hay bales in the village. So let's craft a hoe. Mine the hay bales. Trade them to a farmer for emeralds. And then level up the cleric for the lapis. Oh my gosh. That's going to be so slow. Uh, well, it's definitely doable. <laughs> but it's definitely going to be slow. Okay, here we go. Uh, I think I'll just leave my boat there. Let's get the crafting table down. Uh, we can afford an iron hoe. I don't know how much time that saves us, uh, but let's mine up all the hay bales. My inventory is going to be a problem, I think. Okay, I can pick up the hay bales, but I'm going to need space in my inventory for the uh, to turn them into wheat to trade to the farmer. All right, we're getting all the hay bales. Uh, there's hay bales over there as well. Hello, villagers. Uh, no, no, no. You're, you're not. I don't need this profession. So get rid of all those. Someone become a farmer. And what's in this chest? Nothing. Leather, leather trousers. That's it. All right. Let me out. I need more hay bales. I saw some over here. Okay, there we go. And am I going to have to make a composter, or is there already... Let's see, we took wood. 
Didn't we mine wood from a farm? So there should be a composter somewhere. Alright. Um, I probably need that chest as well, but we could just craft our own chest. Let's go find the farmer and get ready to trade for emeralds. Where was that? Yeah, here we go. Here's the composter. There's the farmer. And I need a chest. Okay, crafting table. Deploy. I need inventory space. Make a chest. Okay, perfect. Uh, let's just put the chest down anywhere. And we need to drop off some stuff. Stuff we no longer need in our inventory. Get out. Food. Iron blocks. Uh, okay, that looks pretty good. And let's turn these hay bales into wheat. And where's the farmer? Do you have a wheat trade? You do not. I'm going to have to reset your trade. Don't go anywhere. I need you to be a farmer for me. Some, someone? Anyone? Hello? Not you. <laughs> oh, is it the wrong time of day? What What's going on here? I don't like what's happening. I'm going to set my spawn here. Oh, there we go. We got, we got, we finally got a villager to come take the uh, profession. Problem is, still no wheat trade. Let's try that again. Hello? <laughs> I need a farmer. Anyone? Not you. You're a pipsqueak. You're, you're small. Go be small somewhere. Hey, there we go. We got a farmer with no wheat trade. What the heck? <laughs> I knew this was going to be slow, but not that slow. Okay, uh, still no wheat trade. Try again. Oh, no, 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 no. Someone be a farmer. Uh, with a wheat trade. I didn't specify. My fault. My bad. Ah, come on, guys. You're, you're killing me here. Be a farmer with a wheat trade. Still not yet. I will murder you. <laughs> Come take this trade. Right here. This workstation. Yes, you. You want to be a farmer with a wheat trade. Dang it. These dang guys. Okay, finally we got a wheat trade. And we can just grab as many emeralds. Here, let's let him level up, actually. You level up quickly. I need to trade more wheat. And then we should have just enough emeralds. Okay, I can come back and trade more wheat, I think. But let's go see our cleric friend. I need to eat. Uh, before we lose the trading day, I need to get this lapis done. And you, sir, uh, give me redstone. Uh-oh. Okay, level up quickly. And you trade lapis now. Yes, there we go. We got the lapis done. Now we can come over here and put down our enchanting table and finally finish the challenge a little bit slow this time, but we got it done. Uh, power one. <laughs> Efficiency on the pick is nice. And how many diamonds do we have left? Six? Six diamonds? Um, here, do we have any iron? Yes. So we can make one of those uh, smithing tables to to make some fancy armor upgrades here. We're going to craft a new look. Uh, let's see, where do I put this? Oh, back here, I guess. And what do we want to make? We have, what are we wearing? We have boots. But we only have six diamonds. So we can only make a helmet or boots. Let's make a helmet uh, like this. There it is. And what do we want to be on the helmet? Here, let's take off this armor too. This is already enchanted. We can throw these in the enchanter as well. Protection on the diamond helmet. Who's pushing me? <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Projectile protection on the boots. Now let's get a new look. We'll put the... Uh, we only have two... Uh, armor trims. So how do we want to do this? Let's see. Ooh, let's use redstone on the helmet. 
And you know what? We'll use redstone on the boots too. That way it'll match it. And there you go. We're all leveled up and we all are also all out of time for this challenge. Uh, so I guess it's time to thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next episode of The Great Enchant Table Race. Yeah, the red looks good as a trim, doesn't it? Especially when you have two pieces, because then it kind of matches. I like it. See you next time.